Good morning scavengers. Here we are another day trying to make another dollar. Curbside scavenging. Let's get it. Ow! There was something chilling over here. Yeah, what is that? A stove top? Yeah, let's grab it. It's one of them glass tops. The glass is busted. Oh, don't make a mess back here. What we got here, light? All right. All right, that's what I'm talking about, y'all. Wonder if she works. Throw some bulbs in her and see. Look like it a little burnt there. We'll check her out. I see little car parts. There's a chair. Take some car parts. All right. Nice. There goes some totes. Anything inside them totes? Some, looks like some sort of feed or rice or something. A grain of some sort. Watch out for golf carts, y'all. These old people will run you over on golf carts. And I'm in the truck. I saw something poking out of this trash, y'all. Looks like a hood. Go with my throat cut. Yeah. Chainsaw case. Nothing in there. That's a Poulan Pro case. A rod. Now I'm telling you guys, in Poulan Pros. Ugh. Disposable things, aren't they? What we got here, y'all. Anything? There goes a light. Hey y'all look, they got my saying on their sign. Hey y'all. Look at that guy, he's stealing my light pole. But we'll wave to him. Oh, he ain't looking at me. <laughs> All right, let's get on the next neighborhood. Does, uh, does this, do you know if this works? Really? I have the instructions. The problem is, I think I left the controls at my father in law. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I've been looking for. Um, I have it's a. It's got a VCR. You want that, the that, 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 That's what I need. I need the uh, the VCR. I but am almost 100. We're cleaning out my father in law. You want the instructions? I have the booklet. Um, I don't think I need them. Okay. Yeah. Um, uh, but I have a bunch awesome. of. Yeah, I have a bunch of VHS you tapes. You know, and I started to put it in. Do you need the cords? I've uh, got cords. Oh, I've got cords for days. I actually have a. I have a little YouTube channel, that's why I got the camera on. Yeah. Um, and I, I go around uh, you know, trash picking and dumpster yeah. diving and stuff. And well, uh, I have the controls, so next next time you buy, if, if, uh, if they're laying out here on the Okay. I think. Okay, so okay. I, I almost plugged it in to see because I have VCRs too. I mean, uh, VHS tapes. Yeah, I have a bunch of old VHS tapes. I'd like to see if they work. I found a big box full of just like really old, like Kung Fu VHS tapes, and I just kind of see if they, they would work. So, cool. yeah, no. Okay. Good. I love it when people come and pick stuff up because I just put it out there. Okay. I took a bunch of stuff to Goodwill. They won't take them. They won't take them? No. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Well, if if anything, if it doesn't work, you can scrap these out and yeah. and, and recycle them. Okay. Well, you have. Okay. Well, have a good day. You too. Bye. All right. Thank you.
Huh? Would the trash have taken that? I don't know, maybe. See, I don't know if they take electronics. Yeah, I'm not sure either. All right, bye-bye. What a nice lady. Super nice. <sighs> what we got here? I see something. Little reach over lamp. Hear the Steve. Go back, Steve. Wonder if there's any brass on there. Uh, we'll see. What else we got? How's this uh, looking? That is what that is. Glad's door opener. All oh, right. Get down on a little garage door opener action. I better put that inside before I damage it. <sighs> hmm. A little scrap, scrap, scrap. Oh, that sign. Oh. What's that? The Easy Shade by Academy. What's in your trash? Well, geez, what we got going on here? See some crutches. Oh, man, look at all this stuff. It's a stool. Some like cleaning out shop. Oh. Santa Claus. Some more Christmas decoration. Uh oh. Man, that's a big old deer, y'all. Help you? <sighs> huh. Look, look at that, some sunglasses and some fishing stuff. Alright, I see some chairs. Let's see if we can get these guys out of here. <sighs> That one doesn't feel aluminum. Just crappy wood stuff. Still in the box. Raised garden bed kit. Ah, that's MDF. Under here, <sighs> what the heck is that?
Man, some stuff in here. Could use that at the storage unit. Hello. You don't mind me going through getting the scrap metal and stuff out, do you? Okay. Nice big old tote here. That okay. It's empty, empty, empty. I'm blocking her driveway. Let's get out of here. Over here, just lollygagging around. Right. Thank you. <sighs> Anything up in there? Yeah, just some sticks. What we got here? Bunch of crap. What's up, little scrabbity scrap scrap on the corner? I'll get you. I think I passed up a little scrabbity scrap scrap. Show do tennis shoes. And little boom box. Looks good, looks good. Magna box. Grabber. Although I like my Sony. Just another half of a rod. Alright. I saw something back here, y'all. Got me uh got me thinking. Got me thinking real hard. What y'all thinking? <laughs> I'm thinking. What is this? Oh, that's for like DVDs and stuff. I think. Oh, we'll check it out. If nothing, I think there's a little scrap in there. Man, I already been down this street. I need to invest into a GPS. Probably save on gas money. All the streets I go down multiple times. I don't even have a radio. The radio just quit working. So I'm just rolling around in the quiet talking to myself. I'm my own best friend. Ooh, ooh. They be calling me the scrap fairy because I be leaving like penny that people don't them. If y'all leave me some scrap, the scrap fairy will come and visit you. I'm just a scrap man, scrap man, scrapping every way I can. Just put some money right in my hand. I'm a scrap man. Scrapping in the USA. Ow! Well, what had happened was they're a ceiling fan, y'all. I'll take it. Oop. Oh, look at that big old piece of scrap. Oh, that's just a fire hydrant. Oh. Let's see if she works, y'all. Power. It's on, y'all. See what we got. VHS wise. We'll throw in Enter the Dragon by Bruce Lee. Well, not by Bruce Lee. Starring Bruce Lee. Does it play automatically or what? 
Look at that, y'all. We got volume. Yes, sir. Victoria Harbor. Look at that. All right, I got me a little TV and a VCR now. So this VCR over here, I'm just gonna sell that in the garage sale, and then this receiver doesn't even work. We need to scrap it out. So, but yeah, nice and compact. Cool. Ow. Let's see if this Magnavox works, y'all a little bit bigger than my Sony, but I like that Sony. I had one of those when I was a kid. Turn that off. Yeah, my older brother had one of those too. Good little radio. All right, power. Okay, plugged in. Let's see. Where the power button be at, yo? Oh, there you go. There's the tuner. And leave things like libraries and parks to the private sector. The other private... See, FM. Yep, good there. Let's see if the CD player works. I got a CD in here. It's called Fat Beats. All right, disc in. Play, where's the play? Oh, there's a the play button. Yep, it works. All right, all right, all right. Hey, I don't know. That thing might get a little bit louder than my other one, my Sony. So either way, could sell either one of them in a garage sale now. So super sweet find, y'all. Ow! Those are cool!
All right, all right, all right, scavengers. Another successful day of getting some stuff. Wasn't the, uh, wasn't a really solid day uh, in the way of uh, picking things on the curb, but that's to be expected. It's the end of the week. And, you know, once you get past, once you get to about, you know, Wednesday, Thursday, you know, everything from there, like, usually that's the people's second uh, trash run of the week. So it's always, mostly always, uh, the trash day right after the weekend is the one that you're gonna find the best. So earlier in the week's usually good. Towards the end of the week, it just kind of tapers off. And you know, you get lucky and find a few things here and there, but definitely Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, those are your trash picking days, guys. Uh, anyways, kind of go over what we found back here. This deer, as we saw earlier, uh, I don't think it's something that they had purchased with the lights. I think it's you buy the deer and then add the lights yourself, which is totally cool because that's a big heavy gauge uh, deer definitely resellable i'd like to keep that for myself put some funky lights on it you know maybe give them a tie some big sunglasses or something you know with it just totally cool totally cool uh and then we got this magnavox which we saw totally works uh cd player works i didn't check the cassette player i don't even know if i have a cassette i don't think so um yeah radio cd player works totally awesome i uh, i think it's a little bit louder than the sony so this one may be taking the place of the sony uh, this little Zenith TV VCR combo. I've been wanting one of these for such a long time to, uh, that actually like work works. Uh, Cause that last one we found, it just kept spitting the uh, VHS out. But someone was saying it may have been the VHS tape, but either way, got a new one and check it out. It even comes with the city advantage uh, uh, protection plan certificate from Circuit City y'all. Like legit, I could take it back to Circuit City if I could find one. Uh, then we got some little tchotchke stuff, you know, this, like the little bow and arrow, and this is typically stuff that I would put, like, in the free bucket at the garage sale. These cool little toys we saw here that, you know, they really get down, Ugh. they get, oh, yeah, roundhouse to the face, Ugh. yeah, so those, those are fun, those get down, some little kids will love to have those, I don't think they're, uh, like, old vintage type toys or anything but they're still pretty cool uh, this was that curtain rod we found totally new still has the brackets in the packaging we just went ahead and taped it there and then this little divider it's a metal divider it's a good heavy duty you know office uh commercial grade divider um almost industrial type people people like that kind of stuff the uh little raised garden bed kit it's all in there the box just uh it was a little damp we're letting her air out and we'll tape it up pretty good and uh but the, it's not actual wood in there it's faux wood so it's not rotted or anything like that Let's see and then we did our scrapping and uh you know i hope you guys enjoyed getting to see how some of that gets done another garage sale item here christmas tree stand um maybe a little project piece it's kind of funky up top but the legs are cool you know totally you can reupholster that this green thing i have no idea what that green thing is it kind of goes up and down almost like a stool or a step I don't know, did I find it with this one? Maybe, I think I may have found it with this one. And this is obviously a step. It needs to be cleaned up a little bit, but you know, you probably get five bucks, five, 10 bucks for that, you know, if you clean it up real good. Uh, got an aluminum chair and then a, uh, uh, a layout lawn chair and both of them are good shape, the aluminum one. And, and that reminds me, I wanna go ahead and uh, apologize to the gentleman. A few videos back was telling me about the aluminum rocking chair and how they're going for quite a bit on eBay. I misunderstood him. I thought he was talking about these aluminum chairs. And uh, when I went back, sure enough, it was the aluminum rocking chair. And lo and behold, they, they are listed for quite a bit on eBay. I don't know if people are selling them for that, but I totally scrapped that sucker out when, I mean, even if I could have got $10 for it, that had been like way more, way, way, way more than it was a scrap. So, but anyways, I apologize. That's my bad. I didn't mean to, you know, ruffle any feathers but okay and uh yeah so that's pretty much it you know the ballast toys tchotchke stuff you know uh the scrap back there that canopy um and that was in the blue bag the whole frame and everything was there but the canopy was gone so i'm just gonna go ahead and scrap that out i find those all the time like all the time and uh so yeah we're gonna go ahead and scrap that sucker out and then that back there but we're not going to do a scrap run today uh we're going to do some dumpster diving tomorrow and uh, hopefully we fill her up and can get a, a a scrap run in but if not we'll have a scrap run here in the very near future but uh anyways alrighty guys well hey i appreciate y'all tagging along as always it was a total pleasure uh i'm mike the scavenger your host and the dude in the show in case you didn't know 
And uh, yeah, be sure to hit all the buttons and stuff. Look at me up on Instagram. Down in the description, a couple links, get y'all some merch, t-shirts, stickers, guys. See if we can get some more stickers going. But uh, all right, like I said, we're gonna get back at it with some dumpster driving action for you next. <laughs> so y'all take care.